Hello everyone. So as we promised that we are in Rishikesh, <laughs> and as we promised that in Rishikesh we will tell what is yoga, why yoga I call always as a social terrorism. Understand one thing very clearly. Yoga has a different types, like Raja Yoga, Karma Yoga, Bhakti Yoga, and Gyan Yoga. Raja Yoga is means the king of yoga. which includes the main patanjali yoga sutra which is telling about the eight limbs of yoga yama niyama asana pranayam pratihar dharana dhyan samadhi and this has to be practiced only when you are alone why because you need to withdraw your physical senses from the world and totally focus inside yourself If you practice this in the society then what will happen that your energy will be pulled back again and again into your emotions created by the social world and you will feel a kind of not a proper connection between the social materialistic life and the life of what you are practicing raj means king so this is called like a king yoga also why because by this the results are 100% guaranteed like if you practice ashtanga yoga which is a part of viraj yoga you will get 100% samadhi but to get this 100% samadhi you have to follow yama and niyama and in yama niyama it's impossible to follow between the society when you live in the society it is almost impossible to follow yama and niyama that's why most of the yogis they used to leave the world and go to the mountains go to the forest to practice modern yoga it has been invented by krishna macharya and like we can call the krishna macharya is like a father of modern yoga and he started this yoga for making money he wanted to make money so he started to demonstrate this asanas to the british officers and british officer used to pay him money so the modern yoga has only one purpose it is used for making money nothing else it can do in the life and when you make money either you make money in the material world or either you make money in the spiritual world the money if it is made without the conscious awareness it always lead to depression look the people around you look the people around you 70 to 90% of the yoga instructor all around in the world they are women and these women they are in single they are not having relationships so they are single and among this 70 to 90% of the women those who are single they want relationship they want family they want husband but they cannot have it why understand what yoga does when you are practicing a yoga you may check the hormone level of a person and definitely after one hour of practice of yoga if you again check the hormone of the hormone level of the person you will find the testosterone in the body of that person is high and when testosterone is high in the women body definitely it affects her menstruation cycle her mental health and her physical health along with this it changes her conscious awareness and she starts to have her own space she don't like to share it with anybody to have a family to have a relationship you should share your life with somebody you should open your space but when you practice yoga you see the people around you who practice yoga they like to be in their space they do not like to share this space they do not want somebody to come and be a part of this space and that is why they are becoming day by day more alone more alone more lonely more lonely they can just live with this i always say yoga is a show, greedy girlfriend she does not like you to be with anybody else she want you to be only with herself with nobody else and if you will practice yoga you will can never have a normal materialistic life you can never have a normal relationship you can never have a normal business you can never have a normal social life you can never have a normal family if you see if you don't believe me go to the people who are the very very big gurus of the oh ruk ja oye gir jayega चल 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 सो यू कैन सी दैट दियर नॉर्मल लाइफ 
is disturbed. They don't have proper family life. They don't have proper materialistic life. Maybe they became very popular. They became very uh, famous. But when you see their wife, their children, they are not having normal connection with them. Huh? So yoga is good, but to if you really want to renounce the world. If you do not want to renounce the world, but still you want to practice the yoga, yoga will just create a confusion in your head and it will spoil your life. According to me, the yoga is a modern yoga is a social terrorism. Ancient yoga definitely leads to samadhi. But the modern yoga, the one thing is very clear that it will lead you to depression. And this depression has no solution. Nobody could heal your depression if you get a depression through yoga. So save yourself. Don't get into it. Do not practice yoga before understanding the real philosophy of yoga, before meeting a good, good master who can explain you all the negative sides of the yoga also. Not only the positive sides. Not because of you are going to get a good body and you will have nice figures and you will, you will look more younger. What you will do with this young body if you cannot have the material world? You cannot have material world with the yogic practices. You will be lost. Most of the people I see today, even in here in Rishikesh, before that also, they are, their faces are, are like off, something is wrong with them. Their face is like sad, that somebody died in the house or something like that. They are not enjoying the life. They are practicing yoga, six hours, four hours, three hours, two hours, but nothing is happening. No spark is there in, your, in their life. So I will say, according to me, yoga is a social terrorism and you have to save yourself from it. If you really want to go for it, then renounce the world, go to forest, go to the mountain, find a suitable master and practice it. Then only it works as a king yoga, raj yoga. Otherwise, it is just a depression yoga. I always say that the modern yoga has three limbs and an ancient yoga, which is the part of this culture, it has eight limbs. The modern yoga has three limbs, that is asan, breathing and depression. There is nothing, no other destination. You will lead to depression only. You will fall into depression only if you practice yoga without understanding the philosophy of yoga. Okay? So as we promised that we will make, we will share from Rishikesh why yoga is a social terrorism. We did it. Meet you in the Vrindavan to share, to know what is the real Krishna, who is the real Krishna, how to accept him. Wait for the next video which is coming from Vrindavan. Namaste. Thank you all.